This car a good investment? I don't know. It's got rust, dents, and scratches. Most people would pass it by or not invest at all to make it better. Perhaps seeking something a little flashier. You have to be able to look under the hood, whether it's a car or a company. That's the way to see what will perform for the long term. That's the basic idea behind one investment strategy we've pioneered to great success throughout economic cycles. The carve-out. Carve-outs are incredibly complicated. The mechanics, the unique financing requirements, the demand for a fresh strategy, and the need for strong C-suite leadership. We buy divisions from some of the largest and most respected companies in the world. Their CEOs and boards want to know that the buyer is capable of getting the deal done. They want to know we will take good care of the company and the people. Carlisle has that experience and that trust. The Carlisle approach to a carve-out begins with a thesis. How can we grow a company in a way the previous owner couldn't? An example, when Sunoco spun off these refineries, we saw what was possible. We have invested approximately $600 million to upgrade and improve the plants and to adapt to the energy revolution in the United States. We invested in growth and in jobs, and it's working. Alongside management, Carlisle acquired TCW, a global investment firm from Sokgen. In the first two years of our ownership, assets under management grew by 60%. Success is built on having a thesis and testing it by bringing in executives who help us with diligence. As we look to buy Johnson & Johnson's diagnostics business, our key external advisor was there throughout the due diligence process. On the day we closed, he started as CEO, investing his own money alongside our limited partners. Whether it's around the globe or around a racetrack, Carlisle Carveouts have succeeded because of insight and execution. Here's another high-octane example. Exalta was a paint and coatings company. They focused on the transportation and industrial sectors, including race cars. They had promise, but it wasn't DuPont's core business. We saw an opportunity. After the carve-out from DuPont, we essentially found ourselves with a $5 billion startup. We had to name and rebrand the business, find a new headquarters, transition the IT systems, and create a new strategic direction. In less than three years, we've reimagined the company, built a new brand and culture. We're also investing over $200 million in technology over the coming years, including the construction of new R&D facilities in the US and in China, and hired hundreds of new people We've reorganized to put our customers first and to grow. Exalta is thriving. We took the company public in less than two years, and Warren Buffett recently bought a large stake in the company. With the right insight and the right team, carve-outs can unlock tremendous value. In the past few years, we've completed more than a dozen major carve-outs. Across continents and across funds. Here's the bottom line. When value is locked inside a company, it takes a firm like Carlisle to get it out. 